Sign conventions when we're dealing with heat and what? Okay. Uh, in case of heat, the uh, letter Q is a commonly used symbol for heat transfer. And we say that if heat goes into a system, okay, then we say that the energy of the system increases. So we assign a positive value for heat. Okay. So we say when a system absorbs heat, we're looking at a process that is endothermic. Endo means going into, right? Thermic has to do with heat. So when Q is a positive, assign a, Q is assigned a positive value when heat flows into your system. If heat flows out of your system, we assign a negative value for Q because that would mean what? If heat flows out of your system, the energy of your system is dropping. Okay? So we assign a negative value for Q. So let's just uh, quickly check that concept. A, part, a pot of water at room temperature is placed on a hot stove. Let's say 5,000 5, calories of heat is transferred. Q for the pot of water is blank, and Q for the stove, oops, and Q for the stove is blank. Ready? Water is colder than the stove, so the energy transfer is from the stove to the pot of water, right? Okay, I need one more. So Okay, for the pot of water, did heat energy go into the pot of water? It got in temperature. In, so energy flows into the water. So positive Q for the water and negative Q for the stove. Good.